Without objection, gentleman from Florida is uh, recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, if you tuned in to last week's episode of UCUT, then you may recall that Republicans resorted uh, to a legislative trick in an attempt to cut much needed funding from the Temporary Aid to Needy Families program. This cut would have been another break for the rich at the expense of the poor. Instead of providing financial support, job training, and child care subsidies to low-income families with children. Fortunately, this measure this week, Republicans seek to sell or stall the important business of the House yet again with a new list of proposed cuts. While the U-Cut program has been touted by Republicans as a partnership with the American people, a more fitting name for the program would be Cut You, because it can hurt everyday Americans while doing little to cut the federal deficit. What Republicans fail to mention is that the U-Cut program is inherently selective and therefore biased. Neither online or cell or voters are able to vote to save a pro program rather than cut it. Further, the U-Cut program conveniently targets only those who have internet access and cell phones, which disproportionately leaves out both the poor and the elderly. I'll talk a little bit more about Cut You later on this evening. For what purpose does the uh, gentleman from Virginia seek recognition? Mr. Speaker, I ask unanimous consent to address the House for one minute and revise and send my remarks. Without objection, the gentleman from Virginia is